Hello again, and welcome back to Sunny School. Before we get started, let's go over what we will be covering today. First, we will go through the teacher's guide step by step. Then, we will give you some helpful tips to better prepare for your classes. As mentioned in the previous video, we highly recommend that you have your teacher's packet with you and follow along. Each month, the teacher's packet consists of a teacher's guide, big book, audio CD, class lesson supplies, and access to Google Drive. Now that we have everything ready, let's get started. Please open your teacher's guide to page two. As you can see on the top of the page, you will see the learning goals of the lesson. Please read this part carefully, as we will build on these goals in future lessons. As you can see on this particular class, the goal is to introduce ourselves and learn how to shake hands when we greet each other. Next, read the key words of the day for this unit. The key words for this unit are hello and name. Under the keywords, you can find the teacher's resources. This is a list of all the things you need for this particular lesson. Please have your resources ready before you read the teaching process, so you can physically practice using the resources as you read the directions. It is much easier to understand the point of the lesson and remember how to use the resources when you're actually going through the teacher's guide with them. If you take a look at the very end part of the unit, you will be able to find directions on how to make the teacher's resources. And don't forget to prepare the big book materials as well. You can find the cutout items at the very back of the big book. They are labeled with the numbers of the pages you will use them on. Please remember that once you make your resources, you can use them for years to come. And in some schools, teachers share their resources. We highly recommend that you organize them like so, in a box using numbers and zipper bags. Now that we have prepared our resources, let's move on to the teaching process. The class starts with the theme song of Sunny School, Hello Sunny Song, which is the first track of the CD. The students will warm up and get ready for class whenever they hear this theme song. Next, play the I Like Me song, which is the song that is related to today's lesson. For those who have beam projectors, feel free to play the media video. After singing the songs, the main lesson begins with the opening of the big book. The big book is a bigger version of the student's book. Follow the guided script and make sure to keep every single one of your students engaged. Sometimes there's a small activity in the big book, like this one. During this particular lesson, there is a magnetic name tag activity where students learn how to write their names. After the big book, we move on to the teacher's activity. Please note that the teacher's activity is designed for an interactive learning time. So when you play out the activity, make sure to take your time to be interactive with his children. Make lots of eye contact and encourage everyone's participation. Next, we have the student activity. There is a simple activity for the students to do as they review the lesson. They are usually sticker or tracing activities. As you are monitoring the students complete their activity one by one, please ask the question on the bottom of the page and remember to guide them as they attempt to form an answer. And of course, give lots of praise and high fives when they answer. When all the children are finished, please play the song, in this case, I Like Me for the last time and wrap up the class. Sometimes you could ask the students to come out and perform the song and actions with you. 
Now that we just went through the teacher's guide step by step, here are some extra tips that might come in handy. First, here are some tips on how to plan your calendar and some helpful resources you can use when you send announcement letters to the parents. When you open the book, you will see each book is divided into two parts and then two units. Also, you can see the first three lessons are language-based classes and the last units are activity-based classes. Most schools cover the four lessons of each unit Monday through Thursday and then repeat and review the highlights of the unit on Friday. And in some cases, two lessons are covered per day for weekend programs. Now check out the Google Drive. There are lesson plans to help you make your calendar and lots of pictures of teacher's materials and student crafts that are helpful resources when making announcement letters that go to the parents. Also in the G Drive, there's an ebook that you can use in your classroom if you have a beam projector. Also, there are audio files so you can play the songs through the computer instead of the CD and video resources that are related to the lesson. Last but not least, this is a tip about the Sunny CD songs. There are four CDs for the entire year. The first CD covers March to May, the second, June to August, the third, September to November, and the fourth, December to February. Please encourage the parents to listen to the CDs as often as they wish during the week when the students are outside of school. Thank you for watching! <laughs> please like and subscribe! For more videos, please click here! Thank you! <laughs>